So everyone, welcome to Backstage. This is the part of our show where we talk to brilliant, inspiring guests about their lives, their loves and their connection to football. Yes, Alvaro, joining us today is electronic music pioneer Kelly Lee Owens and FIFA's chief women's football officer, Sarai Behrman. Kelly, Sarai, thank you so much for being here. Welcome to FIFA Play On. Thank you. Thanks for having me. Thank you so much. Kelly hails from Rutlin on the North Wales coast. She's released two critically acclaimed albums and countless EPs, singles, remixes, and a very exciting new project with the FIFA Women's World Cup. So, you know, I can't wait to chat about you today um, <laughs> and, and about this project you're doing together. So welcome to the show. How are you doing today? Good. Yeah, very good. Excited to be here and finally be able to like talk about it with other people. I've had to keep this to myself for a while now and, you know, kind of uh, create it. And obviously I'm very much in my own bubble when I'm doing that, apart from, you know, with the FIFA team back and forth, which is in itself a collaboration and has been wonderful. But yeah, to be able to now talk to other people about it is really exciting. So Amazing. Good stuff. Amazing. And Sarai, <laughs> you played a key role in the delivery of the FIFA Women's World Cup in France, the most successful Women's World Cup to date with 1 billion viewers worldwide. How are you doing? You know, tell us about that, that World Cup and, and uh, the work you've done and obviously the work that's going to be uh, getting us ready for the exciting 2023 World Cup. I'm doing good. I've, I feel like I am in this incredibly privileged position. I have a dream job. You know, I am able to work every day in the women's game, which is something I'm so passionate about. Uh, and the momentum that we have right now after the Women's World Cup in France that you mentioned, Eni, is absolutely massive. And the mm. coolest thing about this is now we're building up to the next edition in 2023. And we've got so many great new way outside of the box unexpected things that we're doing like working with kelly um so yeah it's going to be groundbreaking and i'm super excited amazing that gets me excited <laughs> <laughs> so first of all kelly i'm i'm really excited to talk about uh the song because you know uh, this is kind of a, a soundtrack and and you know especially tailor-made you know for the women's fifa world cup and that's going to be hosted in australia and new zealand 2023 and, you know, as a songwriter, I know that's kind of, there's different approaches, you know. So how, how was your approach on this um, rather epic, I have to say, uh, you know, <laughs> soundtrack? Because it sounds really incredible. And um, I just would like to know how you go about, you know, on writing a song like this, other to writing a song for you, for example. Yeah, exactly. Well, obviously, you know, I have, um, with my own thing, it's whatever comes to me and however I'm, I'm feeling about my own personal life. And what's interesting about this is actually, of course, it's very collective. This whole thing is a unifying experience. And like I say, from the word go, it's, it's a full collaboration. And the use of language was so beautiful. It was like just unifying community, inclusion, nature, you know, um, kind of talking about just like the land itself and, and the people themselves, obviously in Australia and New Zealand, but really making this a global event that was so important to them. And um, the inclusion of nature and natural sounds, the organic world is something I'm interested in. And I sample sounds from nature all the time anyway. I always carry a condenser mic around with me and I start tracks that way anyway. So for me, this was just ticked all of my boxes anyway. And I feel like we were the kind of the perfect partners really to, um, to write this track together. <laughs> 